Bitcoin. Welcome to Countdown to the Playoffs. I'm Rudy. This is Brad, Robert, and Quintavious. We're here to talk to you about who we think is going to be in the Final Four of the College Football Playoff. Now, guys, my, my four picks are Michigan State, Utah, LSU, and TCU. And I would have to say my favorite out of this group, just because of the quality opponents that they play and the strength of the schedule, is LSU. Uh, I really think Leonard Fournette is a beast and he's going to be hard to be stopped. What do you think, Brad? I agree with you on that, but my college football picks are Ohio State at 12 0. They have a weak schedule until the last two games of the season where they play Michigan and Michigan State. But they have so many athletes on the field, I think they're going to come away with the wins and go undefeated. Then I have Alabama going 11 1. I think the Ole Miss game was a fluke. I don't see Alabama losing anymore. They have a great defense, yeah. and that's what you need to be a good team. Mm -hmm. And I have TCU going 11 1. They lost to West Virginia again. They lost to West Virginia last year, and yeah. I see it happening again. But I see them beating Baylor because they have the number and then going into the college football playoff. Then I have Utah going undefeated. They have a high-powered offense. Absolutely. Great defense. They swarm to the ball, but they also play in the Pac-12, which is a pretty weak conference yeah, in my yeah, opinion. Yeah, I, yeah. I'm an SEC fan. So. <laughs> and they only play one more ranked team, which is UCLA. That's true. So we'll see what happens. But my favorite team is Alabama. I, see, I think they're the best college football team right now. They have a great defense. They run the ball well. Their front seven on defense is incredible to me. They're NFL players in the college level. So I have Alabama as my favorite right now. What do you think, Quintavious? Now, I actually have some more sleeper picks in mind. I have Iowa, and they are right now an undefeated team with no real threats to their schedule. And so look for a real huge upset in the Big Ten Championship. I also have Baylor. They are a team that can and will score. At, they are a team that can and will score on you at any time that they like. I also have Clemson. Now, this is a team that are undefeated, and a lot of people are sleeping on this team, but look for an upset on November 7th when the Florida State Seminoles roll into Death Valley. That is going to be no easy task for Seminoles. Mm -hmm. Now, last but not least, I have LSU. What else needs to be said? Leonard Fournette. He's not just a man among boys. This man is like a giant among toddlers. <laughs> so, and couple that with... Uh, the defense that they have, and Brandon Harris, they finally have a serviceable quarterback, Brandon Harris, and he can get the job done. So right. LSU is my favorite. But how about you all? I have Ohio State struggling against Michigan, but making it into the college playoffs, winning the Big Ten. I have Texas A&M beating Alabama. I have Utah winning the Pac-12, and I have Clemson making it in. No TCU or Baylor in mind. No championship game, no, no college playoff. There we go. All righty. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. That's all the time we have today. For everybody on the panel, I'm Rudy Crowder. Have a good day.